Jacaranda Insights for Wednesday the 1st of May 2024 and quite often the first day of the month the cards are a little bit of a theme of what the month is going to be like. So here we have the Page of Cups, the learner driver in his emotional state, looking at the fish that he's just taken out of the ocean there and examining it. So it's us examining what our feelings are telling us, how we feel good if we're doing something that we love, if something uh, isn't right, we get that real twist in the stomach, we get that real uh, dread in your heart, you start going 100 miles an hour with your thoughts. So they're signals that you're not in touch with your heart, you're not in touch with your emotions, your cup is got a fish in it and it's flapping around and it's not knowing what to do, you're in a confused state. So the learner driver page, just at the beginning of this day and this month, just tells me that we need to slow down and perhaps learn something. We need to learn something about ourselves, about our emotional state, how to read it. We may even need to learn something to do with your emotional state. This fellow, when he's young, and he's, to me it's like when you're young and you've got a boyfriend for the first time and you're adoring them, looking at them, and only focusing on them and nothing else matters around you. So they're taking your total focus like this fellow is looking at this fish. There's plenty more fish in the sea, guys, <laughs> the old saying. But also, if you put that fish back before it dies and let yourself be as open as an ocean, what emotional things can then come in? Like if you're limited in what you judge people and you're no, that can't happen and you're restricting yourself really of learning new ways of feeling. So the next card is a reverse of the eight of wands and this is your purpose and mission is wands. Now that normally means upright, that there's news coming in. To me, it's very similar when it's in reverse. It just sort of says to me that uh, the information has left. So I believe the eclipses, the full moons, the new moons, uh, the Mercury retrograde, it's all about giving us information that we can use. And to me, when the eight is upside down, it's literally the spear has left the building and it's starting to come down anyway. It could even mean that you've been the one that started the communications, you've reached out, you've done the inquiries rather than waiting for news to come in which would be upright so there you go last card queen of cups so it's again about your feelings but this time by the end of the day you're feeling quite in charge quite on your throne your angels are with you you've got your little trinkets on the little island there so you don't need much uh, in the way of material things to make you happy because you're realizing that happiness comes from within. So I'm loving the Queen of Cups. Look at look at the size of her urn. It's like a massive big trophy, isn't it? And she's looking at it admiringly of all the things that have gone down in her life. She's wearing her spiritual dress. She probably felt like jumping off this cliff at some stage in her lifetime, but no, she's hung in there. And this cup's got wings on it. So to me, she's ready to expand even more from her worldly and wise life's experiences. So I love the Queen of Cups because she is a beautiful person. She's the sort of person that you would go to and she would just be so nurturing and loving and make you a meal and let you get it all off your chest. So she's evolved. So I'm thinking Page of Cups at the beginning of the day, not so evolved and perhaps in a bit of a panic about what's going on in the world, come back to your feelings, let your feelings be your guide. The news from last month is going to sit and settle in and you even may be the one taking control. And by the end of the day, you'll be sitting very relaxed on your comfy sofa and feeling really proud of where you've come and how far you've come in this lifetime. Numbers, the queen is one, eight, that's nine, and another one is 10, and 10 rolls back to one, and one means that you're in charge again. We had that the other day. You're the pioneer of your life, the leader. You're the magician in the tarot. High five, have a lovely day, everyone.